sound sleep apnea, which can sound like dreadful snoring. But did you know one of the world's oldest instruments could actually help cure it? Well, this is the didgeridoo. It's an Australian instrument. This actually, believe it or not, can help with snoring, sleeping during the day, or sleep apnea. And what you're looking at there is, in sleep apnea, the tissue in the back of your throat literally prevents airflow from going down into your trachea. And unfortunately, that's when people startle awake, they're gasping, they're choking. This instrument right here can promote something called circular breathing. And when you look at this, you're literally breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. Not through your nose, then out through your mouth. At the same time, breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. So you got to get fill your mouth with air, right? You use the air that's already inside your mouth. Mm -hmm. You push that out to keep your lips vibrating, which is what creates the sound. And then you take a very quick sniff of air in through the nose at the same time. Now, it's not as difficult as it sounds. That sounds pretty hard. Yeah. Yeah. You're using yeah. air that's already in your mouth to keep your lips vibrating as you take a quick sniff of air. Do you want me to demonstrate it real quick? Yeah. Well, with the didgeridoo, we've tried to exercise the muscles of the upper airways, and thereby the collapsibility of the airways is reduced, so we don't snore anymore, and you have less sleep apnea. Snoring occurs when the muscles at the back of the throat relax and collapse in on one another causing them to vibrate as we breathe in and out. In most cases, it simply causes a vibration and that annoying noise. But in some cases, the muscles get stuck together, blocking the airways and effectively stopping the patient from breathing. It's called sleep apnea. And at the very least, it leads to the patient constantly waking up. But in the worst cases, it results in high blood pressure and heart disease. And what I'll do is I'll draw my hand toward my face as I take a breath. This strengthens the upper airway in a way that no That's other musical cool. instrument does. <laughs> In addition to the good vibrations of the didgeridoo is the technique of circular breathing it requires. To keep their note continuous, players have to breathe in through the nose at the same time as breathing out through the mouth. And that strengthens exactly the muscles that collapse during snoring and sleep apnea. At first I had uh, 17 sleep apneas per hour in the night and uh, I was snoring. And after five to six months, I was I wasn't a snorer. I had no snoring uh, acoustic, and uh, I hadn't apneas. <laughs>